What's that, dudes? What is going on, guys? It's Jake. I'm back with another Beyblade news video. Now, this time I'm covering two different little sets of news. Now, first up, I'm going to give kind of the final information over the Beyblade Burst B100 release, which is going to be Requiem Spriggan. Now, I first kind of like first news video I did, it kind of showed you what the layer is going to look like and then what it could be, like what the forge disc could be and like what the driver could be. But overall, that has all been revealed. So there is actually a better picture of what the whole entire bay is going to look like. Now, you see a slightly better picture of Requiem Spriggan, but we already knew everything about that. And then the disc is going to be zero, like I thought it would be. And then the driver is called Zeta, or Zeta, which is actually a really, really interesting driver. If you guys remember Very Eris back in, you know, the Metal Fight or 4D days, it was able to change modes between like three different modes. And it's like the same that was on like Dronzer S, I think. I think Dronzer S back in the plastics. Well, that is making a return on Requiem Spriggan. It's kind of the Beyblade Burst take on it, so you're able to change between different modes. How many modes? I'm not sure. Um, I think it's going to be three, but it might be two. I'm not really too sure. But now, guys, move on to the brand new news. Now, this is over the Beyblade Burst B101 release, which is going to be a new random booster. Yeah, a new random booster. <coughs> but yeah, it's going to be the new random booster. The prize bay is going to be Beat Kukulkin. Kukul... Kukul... I can't even say it. K Kukulkin. I think that's right. Beat Kukulkin. I really think that's how you say it. I'm trying. So yeah, Beat Macaulay Culkin is going to be released hopefully January. I don't think it's confirmed yet. But if B-100 you know, Requiem Spriggan comes out December 28th, I think January, maybe even early February is kind of a safe bet. But we do have a couple of pictures of what Beats Kukulkin is going to look like. You know, they're a little bit blurry, they're not the best pictures, kind of like the Requiem Spriggan one wasn't the best picture. But you got to give credit to uh, Maruti for actually taking a picture and then posting it to the WBO. So big thanks to Maruti and then the WBO, links will be in the description. But here is a picture and it has a lot of resemblances. It definitely looks really, really similar to Chaos in its kind of shape and it kind of like really round. It's in like two sections. But apparently its god ability is like the reverse of Shelter Regulus. And Shelter Regulus is, it would have kind of pieces that would flare out whenever it's spinning and when it slows down, it'd come back in. Then apparently it's the direct opposite. And the parts, like the, tr I think it's like a trident, I think. I'm not really sure. Like a looks like a sword or like a trident that is going to pop out, I think, whenever the bay like slows down. Or it could be the opposite, or it could come back in, be the exact same as Shelter Regulus. I'm not really sure, totally, but that is what the God ability is going to be. And honestly, it looks, it looks interesting. It doesn't look extremely, you know, doesn't have an extreme design. Um, it looks kind of like if you were to mix like Sieg Excalibur with like Chaos or something like that. If you were to mix that together, you this is what you get. You get a Chaos with kind of like a sword thing going through it. But really, that's all the information we have so far. There's really not that much at all. But if more stuff comes up, I will tell you guys in another video. All right, so now we're going to get into a little bit of unrelated stuff. Now this isn't directly related to any Beyblade Burst news. I just kind of wanted to talk about my channel a little bit. Just just for like a second. I'm not going to bore you guys. And it's really kind of like a thank you. You might not be able to see that because it's like kind of small. But it says my name right there and how many subscribers. And I'm actually really close to 66,000 subs already. I'm not really sure why. But the month of November has been absolutely insane for me. I've gotten a ton of views, a ton of subs. I think just in this little bit of November, it's November, it's no, about to be November 20th. 
Um, just the first 20 days of November, I've already gained over 5,500 new subscribers, which is mind blowing. And I'm pretty sure that it's gonna be a record month for new subs and it's completely awesome. And I really just wanted to say thank you. But now enough about that. That's basically gonna wrap up this video. If you guys enjoyed or have anything to add about these new Beyblade Burst releases, please leave it in the comments down below and I'll make sure to read them. I'll see you guys next time. Have fun and bay away.